Now clapping for Miss Sikha. Clapping. So Sikha, so what is your speech? Uh, my speech is value of joint family. Value of joint family. Okay, yeah. But nowadays it's a big issue that we should live in joint family or nuclear family. Okay, let's we take some lesson from the joint family. Yeah, you start your speech. So this is Sikha Divedi. I'm Miss. Uh, sorry. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. This is Sikha Divedi. I'm standing here to present my topic before you all. So, firstly, I would like to express my gratitude to my respected sir, who has given me a golden opportunity to address a topic that resonates deeply within everyone's heart. So, my topic is the value of joint family. So, could I start? Yes, sir. So, uh, for I choose this topic because I belong to joint family and uh, for me and as well as for you also uh, family is a very important aspect of our life and uh, my life starts with my family and concludes with it so I choose uh, so there are several factors uh, that's why I choose this topic because in the era of modernization and western culture we often find ourselves drifting away from our culture traditions uh, values morals and roots so it has become very imperative to uh, preserve our culture and traditions so the problem is from where the upcoming generations will learn these things uh, because uh, today, uh, today's generation or today's people don't want to live with the older generation as they think they are unnecessarily burdened to them. Uh, somewhere uh, people's are, parents are so much busy in their work so they don't keep eye on their children. I have seen so many uh, in my surrounding also that children are using their uh, phones at very early age and parents don't see what they are using or misusing it and uh, somewhere children threaten to teachers also so uh, schools are not also paying attention on the students and um, uh, so this is a very important topic to choose to live in a joint family and uh, uh, so the chi uh, ch children will learn from where what to do what not what is right what wrong and uh, how to deal with the difficulties of life how to get uh, how to get handle the pressure of life because i have seen so many places that uh, ch uh, children choose a very easy option to escape from his, their problems that is suicide so uh, in the last week in the, a girl from ug course in a university of lucknow who is living in a hostel committed suicide so i don't think ki it, it is the right uh, option to escape from the difficulties of life any problem is not as much as big that you commit suicide you should share uh, your problems with your family, friends and uh, uh, so children are not uh, learning things better. So, uh, I also want to share so, uh, some ex ex experience of my life because uh, in 2019 my father was diagnosed with kidney failure and uh, from 2019 to 2022 he was on regular dialysis and each and uh, every second day we went to the hospital uh, at the time uh, my cousin brother was only there to help me uh, so and, and, and in the 2022 he was also diagnosed with gangrene so doctors said to cut his legs and there was no any option except uh, operation of angioplasty 
so during that operation doctors called me inside the operation theater and said his vitals are uncontrolled and uh, will have to abort the operation we can't continue so after that my father insisted me to go to the house so we after taking permission from the doctors we brought him to the house and next day was holy and he passed away at the day of after one year uh, in 2023 on 2nd october i lost my mother in an accident so in these difficulties of life i learned so many things from my life and i get support in every aspect uh there is only my uncle aunt and uh, my cousin sisters and brother who always support me to get better and better in everything of my life whatever i am and what uh, whatever i will do in my future is only because of my family so i request everyone to choose to live with a live in a joint family because it is very important for the betterment of upcoming generations so that's all thank you